Hey, it's Damien Gutier, Damien Gutier and Associates Realtors, brokered by EXP. I want to give you a market update starting off with 2020. So a lot of people are asking me if it's a buyer or seller's market, and it is definitely a seller's market. And this is um, it's kind of weird, kind of weird market because we are the cycles of markets typically run eight years um, of you know good to bust to good to bust. And right now we're about 10 years going on 11 years into an eight year cycle. And so it's a seller's market. It's a hot market. Um, nice houses are selling quickly. Um, houses in good condition are selling quickly. Houses not in condition, of course, are sitting on the market. And so, you know, if you're thinking about buying a house, um, you need to be really active. You need to be on top of it. A lot of the nicer houses aren't even hitting the markets. Uh, a lot of the agents are starting to talk back and forth about what's coming. So a lot of the nicer markets aren't ever hitting the market. They're getting sold before they ever hit the market. So reach out to us, reach out to your agent if you're thinking about buying a house. So included in all the market updates, everybody's always asking about the interest rates. And you know, the interest rates over the last year have been up and down, up and down. And we have some people trying to time the market. Highly encourage anyone trying to time the market to not time it. Um, nobody can predict it. Nobody's got a crystal ball. Um, with the elections coming on this year, I would anticipate that interest rates will stay low because both parties want to claim a victory for interest rates being low and the housing market being good. So if I had a crystal ball, I'd say they're going to probably remain somewhat steady through the year. I will say that at some point they've got to raise the interest rates for us to actually get to a healthy economy. You know, we need interest rates for the economy to be healthy, to be somewhere in that 6% range. So this year, all indications are they're going to stay kind of steady, um, but there's no guarantee of that. So if you're looking to buy a house, buy one. If you have any questions about the market, feel free to reach out to me at the contact information below. I'd be happy to help you out. Thanks.